Welcome to Does My Baby Really Need This? Today we're discussing sleep sax. And I don't mean listening to Kenny G during your REM cycle. What's that famous saxophone song? I gotta play it. Sleep sax. So what is a sleep sack? Well, it's essentially a piece of clothing or accessory that helps your baby through the different transitional periods of sleep. So let's cut to the chase right here. Does my baby need a sleep sack? Of course they need a sleep sack. During the first few months of your newborn's development, they're gonna be using a swaddle. But as they get a little bit older, the Moro reflex kicks in. What is the Moro reflex? The Moro reflex is basically the startle reflex that causes your baby to wake themselves up. They'll be sleeping and then all of a sudden, Ugh, where are my keys? Duh, did I leave the oven on? Duh, I forgot to subscribe to Father Lee's YouTube channel. You get the idea. So today, we're gonna help you find the perfect sleep sack, suit, or swaddle for your baby. The nested bean Zen Classic has one distinct feature that separates it from the other sleep sacks. Can you guess what it is? Guys, it's the nested beans. The sleep sack is full of beans. The weight that's positioned here, either on baby's chest or on their back, sort of replicates the feeling of putting a hand on them or comforting them when they're in the crib. The nested bean retails for around $35, it's 100% cotton, and it features a two-way zipper that allows you to do late night diaper changes. It also comes with two adjustable shoulder straps that will grow with your baby. This is a sleep sack that we use at home and it works for our son. He really enjoys the pressure. It really depends what kind of baby you have. If you have a super active baby, the nested bean might not be right for you. It's basically like falling asleep in jeans with keys. The Baby Merlin's Magic Sleep Suit is a mystical sleep accessory that sort of looks like a combination between an inflatable sumo outfit and the costumes from SNL's Hans and Franz. We want to pump you up. The Magic Sleep Suit is designed for back sleeping in a bare crib for babies transitioning out of the swaddling phase. It retails for around $39.95. If your baby is really a Herman Squirman who likes to move around a lot in the crib, this is a great sleep suit for them because it kind of keeps them locked in place. I know that sounds bad, but it's actually really good. The Magic Merlin also features open ends, as you can clearly see, and your baby is not constricted and confined, which is great when they're trying to find their hands or their fingers for self-soothing. This is how my son does it. Mm. No, I prefer alcohol. So here's what's bad about the Magic Merlin. It's a pretty heavy duty sleep suit, and if your baby is a sweater or gets super hot, this is gonna not help them. This is a toasty little sleep suit, so in the summer months, baby's gonna be sweaty and stinky. The Halo Sleep Sack is very popular, very trendy. It retails for about $20, and there's a good chance you probably own one. The Halo is a three-way swaddler that features three different ways to swaddle your baby. A classic all-in swaddle that allows them to reduce the startle reflux, an arms free that allows them to engage in soothing, and a kind of middle of the road where you can have one arm in or one arm out that allows them to transition from swaddling to soothing. So here's what's great about the Halo Sleep Sack. You get three in one uses and these sleep sacks can really kind of grow with your baby. The Halo Sleep Sack is also sleeveless as you can see right here which allows baby not to overheat, and it also comes with an inverted zipper, which allows you access to the diaper for late night changes. So what's bad about the Halo Sleep Sack? One word, Velcro. These Velcro fasteners are loud. If you need to change your baby in the middle of the night and you wanna rip off that Velcro, you're gonna be waking your baby up. The Halo Sleep Sack is a little small, so if your baby is uh, perhaps a little bigger, you might have to buy multiple sleep sacks but I'm not trying to baby shame them. I love a chunky monkey. This is the Zippity Zip. It retails for about $38.95 and is for babies and also flying squirrels. The Zippity Zip is a transitional sleep sack in that it can be used for babies up to three months old all the way up until that baby is three years old. The Zippity Z is a little bit thinner fabric, so it's great for warm climates or if your baby is a real sweater. One of the great things about the Zippity Z is that you can use it for up to three years. Most baby gear can only be used for a short amount of time, so that's a real benefit. And the other thing about it is that 
it comes in cool colors. You can see here we got some green owls on here. A one, a two, a three, zippity z. And if you know what I'm referencing, that means you're old, like me. So why would you not want to get a zippity z? Well, one of the main problems with this is that your baby won't have access to their hand. It has the flying squirrel suit look for a reason, and that reason means you cannot access your hands. Thanks so much for watching Does My Baby Really Need This? If there's a sleep sack that really works for you, throw it in the comments. And if you want other great fatherly content, please click subscribe for new videos every week. Until next time, does my baby...